The ANC has ruled out the amendment of the constitution in order to address the challenges of illegal migration in the country. Do we look at uh, amending the constitution? No, not at all. Um, we're going to formulate a program of action on how some of these resolutions are going to be implemented in the short term and the long term. And uh, the legislative implications uh, for the implementation of some of the resolutions. ANC Secretary General Figil Mbalula was engaging the media on the party's resolutions following the conference. One of which is the resolution on migration, which will see the complete overhaul of the Citizenship Act, Refugees Act, and Immigration Act to meet the new challenges facing South Africa. The resolution states that the ANC led government must introduce a single piece of legislation to deal with citizenship, immigration, and refugee protection. The resolution was subjected to criticism by interested social justice and human rights organizations in the country who argued that the ANC's plan to tackle illegal migration would never hold up against the Constitution of South Africa, which prioritizes fundamental human rights. This is evident in the Minister of Home Affairs, Dr. Aaron Mataledi's core challenges in matters dealing with migration, the most recent being the 12 Afghan nationals who took home affairs to court for refusing them entry into the country and won. In June last year, when the ruling party had its policy conference, we drew a, 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 a new document from the peace and stability of the ruling party, having been initiated by Home Affairs, mm. to say we need to review our immigration laws in this country. There is something that makes us very vulnerable to the immigration laws. The ANC-led government has resolved to review the country's accession into the 1951 Convention on Refugees and 1967 Protocol. This procedure involves depositing the reservations with the Secretary-General of the United Nations. Kani Mapanga, SABC News, Johannesburg.